And we're taking a live look from Walnut Creek. We had some sluggish conditions on 680, really both directions there near the 24 interchange. We can also take a live look from Mount Tam where, well, we have evening conditions and you can hardly see a whole lot right now, but we have hazy conditions as well. Another spare of the air day. We'll talk about that in a second. Partly cloudy skies, though. Similar temperatures tomorrow to what we had today. That being said, it's going to be nice. The weekend, mostly sunny, mild conditions continuing. Cooling trend, though, next week, late next week, possibly some rain. I'll talk about that in a moment too. Spare the air day though, 26 so far this season. So it's a spare the air day today. It's going to be a spare the air day tomorrow and hopefully maybe not the day after that. But in the meantime, public transit certainly encouraged. No wood burning allowed. It is a steep fine right now. Temperatures 60 in San Francisco, 50 sec 57, excuse me, for Oakland, 60 for Hayward, 59 in Fremont. After a chilly start, we sure did warm up quite a bit. So again, we can see more of that tomorrow and here's why. Satellite and radar imagery showing well, some off and on partly cloudy conditions, but nothing really organizing quite enough to bring any precipitation for the time being. Afternoon highs though, 66 Palo Alto, 66 in Mountain View, 66 Santa Clara. That goes for San Jose and Milpita, 64 is where we'll get to in Fremont. Afternoon highs in the East Bay, 66 for Walnut Creek, 66 in San Leandro, 67 Castor Valley, 65 for Danville. We'll reach 64 in Pittsburgh. North Bay and Peninsula, we've got 66 in Petaluma, 64 in San Rafael, 64 in San Francisco's downtown financial district out by Ocean Beach, more like 63. 49ers forecast playoff game on Sunday. We heard from Mike Pelton. It is cold. He placed the game time temperature at zero. I'm a little more optimistic. I think it's going to warm to at least two. So, uh, you know, still going to be pretty cold, though. Nonetheless, certainly cloudy at that. There is a chance of snow. Right now, it doesn't quite look like it, but we'll leave maybe a 10% chance of snow uh, for the Niners game. Either way, it's going to be brisk out there. We will continue to hear from Mike Belton uh, coming up with some more live reports. Crown 4 7 day around the bay forecast shows a lot of sunshine, increasing clouds though into early next week. That chance of rain coming Wednesday and Thursday, it's a little far out right now to call it for sure. Either way, we can for sure say the temperatures are going to finally drop out of the unseasonable range into the seasonable range. We'll see what that'll do to Tahoe conditions as we check our snow bomb ski report and you can see that our base depths are really oh god they're just not that good for this uh, late in the season January you'd like to see more base than this but they've been making a lot of snow up there so this is really a testament to how hard they've been working 31 the best base depth of the bunch here out in heavenly otherwise we have 21 at Squaw and 20 out at Alpine still skiable you can still get out there Grant.